Well, everybody knows Chicago's really serious about its Italian food, especially when it comes to meatballs. But there's a new kid on the block in the West Loop that's giving some Chicago favorites a run for their money, and it's called Nona's. The sandwich is super tasty. It's affordable. You get a really unique sandwich for a great price. It's, it's delicious. Chef Tony, you're the executive chef here, so you know a thing or two about meatballs, right? I do. I grew up making meatballs like at the age of four, I'm not kidding. That's it's a little kinda, bit of child labor. It's kinda, well, it's okay. I, I didn't know any better at the time, and here I am still doing it. You're the new kid on the block. <laughs> I mean, were you a little intimidated oh coming in? Oh my god, in? are you kidding? We're next to some legends of Chicago and not far from a few more. Okay, so tell me, what's the secret to a great meatball? Secret is a few things, but the biggest thing for me is to not overwork your meatball. You don't want something that's really firm, you don't want something that's dense, you want a light, fluffy, pillowy, so you can eat a lot of them. And everything is homemade. Everything's homemade here. Like even the jardinera? Even the jardinera. The only thing that's not is our bread because we can't physically keep up with it. If we were a bakery, that'd be awesome. Well, you know what, I think you should work on that. Yeah, that's nice. I think your meatball is pretty much on its way to becoming legendary, like Whoa. the other ones, okay? Whoa, okay. Um, but you can get it a couple of different ways here, yes. which is cool. Yes, you can. We have it in salad form. We also have a meatball sub that, of course, is probably the, the main way people go here. The meatball sub. The meatball. It's nicely seasoned. <laughs> There's so many different flavors kicking in it. Just spicy enough. It's toasted. It's beautiful. Finally, it's time to eat! Hmm. Oh, man. That is so good. Sweet, okay. salty. A lot of things working there. I don't even need a knife for this meatball because this is how light <laughs> and fluffy and beautiful this meatball is. You can see the texture in there. Yeah, so we roast them after they're formed, um, get a nice mm. crust on them, and then they're braised in tomato sauce. That is so delicious. Good. Oh my goodness. It oh, makes me want to so. speak Italiano. I wish I could be like this <laughs> delicioso. Molto bene. <laughs> You can get the same meatball in Formentos yes, as well. Yes, our restaurant next door, Formentos, has the same meatballs. And that's a great place for if you want to have a big family meal out and it's going to please everybody. Okay, listen, if you're looking for a great place to eat this weekend and you're quick and you want it on the go, you can come right over to Nona's. You don't want to see this. This isn't going to be pretty. Cheers. Ready? Cheers. Okay. Mm. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs>